Hello, all. It's your girl, Tiffany Metal Malicious Black Beauty, your poetic psychic Pisces, High Priestess, aka the light that shines like a diamond, also known as your modern day nun, one who isn't with any coven, a convent, or a covenant. I do thank you all for listening and for watching on tonight. If you would be so kind to please like, share, and subscribe, it would be greatly, greatly appreciated. This is going to be a general reading for the overall collective of any zodiac sign. So please take the messages that apply, leave the ones that do not. Remember that this reading may apply to your past, your present, or your future, as well as it may be pertaining to you or any and everyone in between that you may or may not know. With that being said, guys, we're going to get started. I do hope y'all are doing well and feeling well on tonight. So let's get to your overall messages. Okay, guys, so we're going to get right to your reading. If I did not say so before, guys, we are going to be doing an angel message reading on tonight, guys. So we're going to start. Your overall messages are going to be your uh, your angel messages, okay? And then we're going to get some further clarification for your situation and see what else is going on with you all, okay, guys? So let's get started. Um... Okay, guys, um, the first angel message you have is 1313, okay, which speaks about clarity, guys, okay? The next angel message you have is 444, which speaks of protection. We have 000 is the next angel message you have, which speaks to guidance. We have angel number 333, which speaks to potential. And last but not least, we have angel number 123, which speaks to vision. Okay, guys? So I definitely feel like you all could be gaining some type of... I, I feel like with clarity being here, um, your tuition, your, your intuition, actually, somebody could be worried about their tuition, something pertaining to your tuition, or you could be getting some type of clarity as it relates to your tuition, because I was trying to say intuition, intuition came out. So that's a quick side note for someone, okay? Um, clarity is all about, uh, can tap into your intuition. Clarity can speak to truth of a matter and different things like that or what have you okay so you could be definitely gaining some type of clarity on something okay this could have something to do with uh your protection within something that you're currently dealing with you could definitely be getting some type of guidance of some kind this could be spiritual guidance or this could be guidance for some uh from someone else or what have you which is definitely, for whomever you are, you definitely have a lot of potential um, as it relates to the things that you are doing, okay? You definitely have clear vision and could be making some wise decisions um, right now as well here, okay? So as we look at um, angel number 1313, 13, this says... Um, the angel whisper message is, as the storm passes, the clarity is felt faster than lightning is seen against a dark sky. The divine is reminding you that clarity is readily available. All you have to do is ask. So those of you who are needing clarity on something, spirit is definitely telling you that all you have to do is ask for clarity and you shall receive that, okay? Um, this also says that you have weathered the storm and now the sky is clearing, okay? Your affirmation for this, for angel number 1313 is loving energy surrounds me and I trust that the clarity I feel is the answer I need, okay? So you all are definitely gaining clarity, 
on the situation you are currently dealing with right now, okay? Angel number 444, as I said, speaks to protection. And your angel whisper message is as follows. This is your time to make this, excuse me, this is your time to take confidence in all that you pursue. The divine universe is working through you and protecting you. Time has come to allow all the doors of opportunity to welcome you with open arms, okay? And your affirmation for angel number 444 is, I feel the loving care of the divine protecting me. I allow myself to pursue growth and opportunity, okay? So as you gain clarity and whatever you're dealing with currently in your life, you're, you're, I feel like spirit is telling you that you are protected, okay? And whichever direction you are going in your life or whatever you're working on or whatever you're doing, you're protected, okay? Um, there's a lot of growth and opportunities that is happening for you as well, Spirit is saying, okay? So angel number 000 um, is maybe not an angel number that people see quite often, but it actually came out for you. You're definitely getting some type of guidance at this time. And your angel whisper message is you have full support of the divine. The guidance you are seeking is here and your life is moving in the right direction. This is the start of a new beginning. Where one cycle ends, a new begins. Your affirmation for angel number 000 is, I trust in the magic of new beginnings. I feel the support and the guidance that is all around me, okay? So I definitely feel like this is some type of spiritual guidance for many of you. Okay, so this could be guidance from the most high, from your spirit guides, from your ancestors, your archangels, your guardian angels. You could be definitely getting a multitude of guidance um, coming in to you, okay, um, from several different sources, okay? So you're definitely being spiritually guided right now, okay? You could even be getting some type of ancestral guidance as well, spirit is saying. And whoever you are, and whatever you're doing, you definitely have a lot of potential here with angel number 333. Your angel whisper message is your chance to reach your highest of potentials is here. Perseverance has gotten you to where you are. You have been through so much and this guidance is here to show you that you are exactly where you need to be. Your affirmation for angel number 333 is my potential is infinite. I use my strength as my ally to pursue my highest good, okay? So many of you all have definitely been a lot, okay? I've, it, you know, anything worth having definitely doesn't come overnight for most individuals, okay? So I feel like you have persevered, you've worked really hard, you've jumped over those hurdles, you've done, you know, dealt with obstacles and challenges and burdens and setbacks and downfalls and delays and all kinds of things that would have you, but you still have a lot of potential within you, okay? And Spirit is saying that you have reached or are reaching your highest potential, okay? The chance to reach your highest potential is here and now. Okay, and this is the reason why you have angel number one, two, three, okay, with vision being here, because I definitely feel like you have clear vision right now. You're making wise decisions. You know what direction you're going in, what you're striving towards, okay? Your angel whisper message is, your path will not look identical to anyone else's. That is what makes you special. Remember that you... Remember that as you stay the path that feels connected, the path will continue to lead you to alignment. Let your vision be as different as you are. Your affirmation for angel number one, two, three is my path is mine and mine alone. When I follow my path, alignment comes excuse me <laughs> my path is mine and mine alone when i follow my path alignment comes naturally okay 
So your divine path, your life purpose, okay, I feel like your destiny, spirit is saying is that of your own, okay? It may not be the way somebody else did it or look how, like what, you know, somebody else have or how somebody else accomplished whatever it is that they accomplished. Even if you have similar goals, okay, it's not going to look the same, okay? You're on your own destined divine pathway, guys, okay? So let's clarify. We have the Eight of Cups, guys. Clarifying angel number 1313, okay? The Eight of Cups is all about change, okay? Something is definitely changing or shifting in your life at this time. The Eight of Cups can also speak to... Um, fulfillment or empowerment in some ways okay spirit wants you to release what doesn't serve you okay um the eight of cups can also speak to uh you moving on you letting go okay um especially things that were like um, emotionally unfulfilling you okay so something is definitely shifting and changing in your life okay I feel like you could definitely be gaining clarity on the things that you need to release that doesn't serve you, okay? On the things that uh, has you in this emotional, has you feeling like you're emotionally unfulfilled, okay? You're, you're going to have clarity on the things that you need to move on from. You need to let go in some way, shape, form, or fashion, spirit is saying, okay? Yeah. Okay, guys. So to clarify, angel number 444, we get the 10 of coins here. Some of you all may be coming into a large windfall of money, okay? The 10 of coins um, sometimes can connect to family, family legacies, family wealth in some type of way. Um, patriarch um domestic duty lineages uh this can also speak to one buying a house okay um one being privileged having uh safety security stability this also can speak to a state okay the ten of coins is a large windfall of money however the ten of coins can come to someone in any way shape form or fashion okay you could win money by chance you could be giving a lot given or blessed with a large amount of money um you could uh, inherit a large amount of money in some way shape form or fashion okay but with the ten of coins here you're definitely protected at this time this protection energy is around you with this angel number four 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 okay um that's the reason why spirit is saying that it's time for you to take confidence in all that you pursue okay the divine universe is working through you as well as protecting you, okay? I feel like some of you all may be getting some type of protection or getting some type of protection um, when you come into this large amount of wealth here, okay? We have the Ace of Wands clarifying angel number 000, okay? Um, the Ace of Wands is its passion, okay? This could talk about a passionate new start. This could talk about you moving forward passionately, okay? Um, the, the Ace of Wands is all about passion, action, drive. You passionately moving forward. A new passion for love and life, attraction. You're going for what, what you have passion for. This igniting desire is happening within you, okay? Um Yeah. So I feel like as this guidance come in for you, okay, you have this full support of the divine um, guidance that's coming to you. And this is what is like motivating you, okay, giving you that passion, that drive to take action in your life, to passionately move forward in your life, okay? To clarify, uh, angel number 333, we have temperance here, okay? 
Um, temperance is all about perfecting balance in some type of way. Temperance can talk about balance. It can talk about patience, okay? You could definitely be someone who is a starseed. You could be a highly sensitive indigo. You could definitely could be an earth angel or a chosen one, okay? I feel like uh, when the temperance energy comes out, it's someone who has that divine angelic connection to the spiritual realm, to the most high, okay? I always get that loving, caring, kind, generous, compassionate type of energy, angelic type of energy, with the temperance card, okay? And that's the energy you are currently in, okay? There could be a union of opportunity, uh, uh, some type of union of opposites, okay? That come into play, okay? You, uh, The temperance also talks about you doing things in moderation, okay? It's purposeful energy, it can speak to harmony, tranquility, okay? Patience, alchemy, but it's balance and it's peaceful energy here, okay? You have a lot of potential. We have the Empress clarifying angel number one, two, three. So you could definitely be a feminine energy This that is coming off of that temperance energy because the, just like temperance, the, um, Empress energy is naturally that nurturing, motherly type of energy, loving, caring, kind, especially when it's in the upright, okay? So you could definitely be a divine feminine, whomever you are, someone who's sensual and beautiful. You're in that motherhood energy. You definitely could have at least one child. Um, but the Empress automatically comes with that energy of nurturing, creation, abundance, fertility, beauty, art, and different things as such, Okay. So being clarified with angel number one, two, three, like I said, there's something significant to your vision or you having clear vision, okay? I feel like this being, uh, this is the reason why spirit is saying that your path will not um, look identical to anyone else's, okay? Your path is clear. I feel like you're on your destined divine pathway. Okay, you definitely do need to stay on that, stay in your life purpose, continue to strive towards your destiny or what have you. Um, but I can definitely be talking to a feminine energy who is resonating with this reading, guys, okay? So we have calm here, okay? Clarifying angel number 13, 13 with the eight of cups here. So I feel like this is your energy. Um, this is how you're feeling right now. You're in a calm state of mind. You have this inner peace, this... Um, simplicity energy about you okay this also says meditation you could be doing some type of meditative uh, practices you could be meditating you could be praying you know whatever you do to center yourself and your energy okay we also have here profession something is very significant to your profession your work your occupation the job that you do here okay there's going to be some type of protection for you around your protection or, or some type of protection for you around your profession spirit is saying this is also how this large amount of, of abundance stability and security is coming in for you spirit is saying you have some type of expertise talent skills or abilities of some kind here okay with relaxation here some of you could be taking a rest or a break this is sitting here with angel number zero 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 which is talking about guidance this also sits here with the ace of wands here okay this relaxation card this talks about peace again so some of you could definitely have a peace of mind this talks about tranquility okay and easiness okay i think feel like things are going to flow to you easily i feel like um many of you could be getting some type of um the guidance that you're getting especially like spiritual guidance um maybe when you are in a re in relaxation or meditation or uh, peaceful type of energy okay this calmness is over you you have two different cards here that is talking about this one says uh, uh, uh inner peace and then this card here says peace here the first one is calm and this is relaxation here okay so you're in this the energy of calmness and relaxation currently right now okay and this is this is sitting here clear on the energy that is with clarity and guidance here okay so there's some type of clarity and guidance that is coming in for you when you're in a calm relaxed um type of uh energy spirit is saying to clarify uh angel number three 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 
which talks about your potential and temperance here. We get luck here, okay? So I definitely feel like there's some type of windfall of money coming into you. This luck card talks about jackpots, windfalls, fortunes, rewards, okay? Finances, money, resources, basically, okay? And it's definitely coming to you here, okay? This has something to do with your potential. I feel like this is something that you have. This is going to bring you balance as well as this is something that you have waited patiently on as well. We have blessing, clarifying uh, angel number one, two, three. And the empress here okay so there's an influx of blessings that is coming into you that is going to provide you fulfillment well-being as well as enlightenment spirit is saying okay so you are currently in your north node guys okay this is cosmic energy you're in your life purpose okay you're focused on self-love creations and your intentions at this time here um There's something about autumn and a harvest that is coming in for you, okay? Spirit wants you to continue to have trust, to have faith, to have courage. Um, something has to do with divine timing as well here, okay? There's going to be some type of rebirth in the winter as well for you, okay? Something is going to happen in autumn and something's going to happen in winter here pertaining to a harvest and a rebirth here, okay? But there's something that's already in your energy now as far as your profession, as far as some type of abundance that is coming in to you. Yeah, you've had a higher self-activation spirit is saying. You're in the energy of stability, harmony, and flow. There is definitely some type of offer that is coming in for you, okay? Mm -hmm. There's some type of celebrations, gifts, or abundance that is coming to you. And I'm also seeing a feminine energy here as well, Spirit is saying. Okay. That's what's going on here, y'all. Bottom of the deck, I'm seeing the Ace of Coins. Okay. Again, the Ace of Coins speaks to abundance. It speaks to new beginnings and offer coming to you, you flourishing in some type of way. It can also speak to you meeting someone new. Okay. It talks about you being stable, having security, abundance, as well as your potential. Spirit is saying okay that's what's going on guys okay so let's get um let's look at some time frame cards here and see what other messages spirit have for you something could be coming in or happening by the end of the week spirit is saying Okay, something is very significant to the end of the week. Sharon, are there any other messages? Next month could looks promising for you all as well. This is like the end of this this month. We are currently, what, in July, okay? Heading into August. This is the end of the month. Something is happening by the end of this week, okay? And something's very significant to next month looking promising, Spirit is saying. Yeah. The end of the week, okay? This could be in July. I'm seeing July here. So with this end of the week, this could be still talking about something happening in July. But next month, that would be August. Next month looking promising, okay? Something is worth the time. So whatever is looking promising, something was worth the time that you had to wait for something or wait on something. Heard any other messages? 
continue the messages as far as the time. Here to see the time is now. So something, things are flowing in very quickly for you. Something is coming in swiftly, Spirit is saying. You got something that's happening by the end of the week, yet it's still in July. You have something that looks promising next month. And Spirit is saying it was worth the time that you had to wait for it, okay? But we got the time is now. So there's things that's even happening in the now. Something could also be significant about September. Is there any other messages? Yeah, so Spirit is saying, have faith, divine timing is at play in all the things that's going on here. Oh, goodness. You have a lot of things that's happening like in the now. And things to come as well. Because we have by the end of the week here as well as July. Okay. We have next month looks promising. It's worth the time. We have the time is now. And then we have today, we have have faith, divine timing is at play. Okay, so I feel like there's a multitude of things. So time will bring a surprise here, okay? There's something that has taken like divine timing to come in or taken, a, you know, quite a bit of time to come in or what have you. But um, it comes with some type of surprises, obviously, for the good for you. Okay, guys. So those are your messages. I do hope that this is giving you all the truth and the clarity that you were seeking pertaining to a situation you may be dealing with or pertaining to a situation that you may notice someone else is dealing with if you are cross-watching. For those of you who would like to contact me, you can do so at tiff.diamond.36 at gmail.com. You can also follow me on Instagram, which is shine bright like a diamond 36 with the underscore between each word. For any person who's interested in donating to the channel, it is greatly, greatly appreciated. I do thank you in advance. As you can see on the screen, you can do so through Cash App, which is dollar sign tip diamond 36, or through PayPal, which is paypal.me slash at 36 diamond. As always, guys, take care of yourself, take care of each other, but most of all, take care of your baby, Sunny. Remember, this is a wicked, wicked world that we live in. There is wickedness in high places, and there is evil that is lurking around each and every corner, even in a neighborhood near you. So y'all watch your surroundings, watch the company you keep, watch surroundings in the company in which your children are in as well. And considering the fact that you never know when someone may betray you, backstab you, try to hurt you or harm you, honey, keep you some protection on you. Y'all stay awake, stay aware, stay vigilant, and stay prepared because if you stay ready, you ain't got to get ready, baby. Until the next time, peace, love, and light. Namaste. I am that I am created in the image of God.